Prime Minister Moses Nagamutu on Friday led a delegation to the Pomeroon to Panam region, where he engaged residents on a number of issues. The first stop on the agenda was a prayer meeting at the Regional Democratic Council to kick off Harmony Week. This was then followed by a site visit to where Radio Estequibo will be established. Upon arrival, the Prime Minister was warmly greeted by students of the surrounding schools. During brief remarks, Prime Minister Nagamutu explained that the National Communication Network's technical team is ready to begin work on the station, which is expected to be completed by mid-2019. You need to be able to bring our children up with an understanding that this is our country, this is Guyana, and to be able to use radio and other means of communication to educate you, inform you, edu um, entertain you at the same time, but bringing you up as one cohesive Guyanese people. So Radio Esequibo is intended to be playing a small role as soon as we can get it going. Minister of Agriculture Noel Holder later joined the Prime Minister as they interacted with rice farmers from across the region at a town hall meeting. The government ministers listened attentively as the farmers aired their concerns and assured that the matters will be looked into. The Prime Minister emphasized that while Guyana is expected to begin oil production in less than a year, concentration should be placed on the agricultural industry. And that's happening right now in Trinidad and some of the Middle East countries, happening in some African countries, where they concentrate on the oil and oil revenue alone, and they find they have to buy everything else. They have to buy water. They got to buy food. Everything they need, they have to buy. And when the prices go, go down for oil, they don't have the money to buy everything. Following the town hall meeting, he headed across to the Anna Regina ground for the children's mastermind competition, where he was greeted by the many excited youngsters. A donation of sports gear was made to the Department of Education Region 2 on behalf of the Office of the Prime Minister. To top off his visit to the region, Prime Minister Nagamutu then visited the Supernam Stelling, which is currently being rehabilitated. He was given a tour of the site and an update on the works taking place. An estimated time of completion for the rehabilitation was given as March 2019. The Prime Minister's visit is one of many as government officials have embarked upon numerous fan-out exercises across the country to fully brief citizens on what's happening in Guyana. For InfoHub, Anara Khan.